of secret line Like leaves we soar so high Beneath the moonlight The self-touch your hand in mine It gets me every I just did the, the countertops. I really hope that you see that because as of right now, my entire footage from yesterday, super fun day of the lake, and this morning, I can't access. I can't get to it on the drive, the disc, but I can see it here on my camera. And I can't find a cord to hook the camera up to my computer to see if I can access the files that way. So I'm frustrated, but I'm going to get my nails done now. I'm going to get a pedicure. The bottom of my feet started cracking um, this morning when I, actually last night after I got home from the lake. Um, and one of them, I don't know, just really hurts. And so I'm like, oh, I just need to go get a pedicure and get all the dry skin off of the feet. So I'm gonna go do that. Um, it's like two, two o'clock. <laughs> I really wish, I really, really hope you can see my whole morning <laughs> and that I haven't wasted my entire morning. I cleaned the whole countertops, moved things, sprayed them off, did the stove top and all the trays. And um, then I washed by hand my entire case of new Tupperware that I got like a month ago and I just have not taken time. I have taken on the duty of cleaning the countertops now. It was Chelsea's job um, because I get to dictate what jobs each kid gets to do. <laughs> Wiping the counter is one that I would rather do versus unloading or loading the dishes. And I think those two jobs specifically are good responsibility jobs for kids and I don't mind doing a little bit better job at keeping the counters clean myself. Um, so now that Kaylee's gonna be out of the house, I'm not gonna, she's back in town, but I'm not, and that's also what you would have seen yesterday. She's back in town, hopefully. Hopefully you guys know all this. I really don't wanna have to do an update video from all those. And it was a really cute day at the lake. Anyway. Um, she will help out around the house, but she does have a lot on her plate to get ready to move. So I'm not really like assigning her chores, 
but I am starting to have her do your own laundry, pick up your own dishes, you know, do your own things like you're gonna have to do on your own here in just a few weeks. So anyway, that is a lump sum of my morning and now I'm gonna get a pedicure. And then tonight we're gonna go and visit Jason's sister who's here visiting. And if you'll notice, I'm in a black car I'm in Jason's car and it's a great car. I should not complain. I just like my car. I like my settings. I like being higher up. This car hurts to get into and out of because of my knees and I'm just a baby. So I'm driving Jason's car today because he needed to take my bigger car to go up to our store and well up to the hospital where he has the health fair. Today is the last day of his health fair at this hospital and they're taking all the shoes back. The camera does not like me right now. Battery died. Uh, anyway, he took my car to fill it full with shoes to take back to the store after the health fair today. And then he will meet me with hit my car at his brother's house and then we will, I will get my car back. So in the time being, I have his car. Honestly, he should have, he could have taken like the Honda Pilot because then he wouldn't have even had to worry at all about getting it all in. But to pay for gas to go clear up there and back and over to the store, you know, we don't like paying for gas anymore. <laughs> so he has my car for the day, which is fine. But um, Abby and I went on a walk this morning. Uh, my friend wanted to join us. So we went and did three and a half miles for myself. My friend had to leave and I was just like, ah, let's just go. Abby did four miles because she lapped us. I could have walked faster had my friend not been there with me, um, but we were just enjoying our time talking and so it didn't really matter about speed or I wasn't trying to run like I've been doing. I'm not trying to run, I'm just trying to like, just, I'm just trying to build some strength, I guess, and a little bit better endurance. Um, to maybe be able to hike better or something. But anyway, so four miles. Really, like by, I've actually been to Costco too with Abby. We ran to Costco on our way home from walking uh, and I got a Caesar salad kit and an extra bag of lettuce. Um, I've got Parmesan cheese and Caesar dressing at home, but I was worried about not having enough of either. Um, and so, We'll combine all of that, make a big Caesar salad for dinner tonight, and then I got a pineapple and a new box of brownie mix. In fact, I need to tell Ashley, can you make the brownies? Because she said she would. It's not too hot today. It's only 80, so it's not gonna like ruin the house if we <laughs> cook brownies. Can you make the brownies now? Oh, Chelsea sent me a photo of the chickens. Oh, I think this is the one uh, we were talking yesterday about how she like gets hot and feathers her wings. Okay, let's go get a pedicure. Okay, toes are done. They look cute with my nails and my shoes. And I still have money on my gift card, which is fantastic. I can come back. Maybe I'll, I don't know, get my fingers done as a follow up later on. Okay, back at home, I have what appears to be a white pineapple. <laughs> I don't know why it doesn't have more color. Cut that up. Um, I was gonna do a bigger bowl, but I realized I got a pine small pineapple. Um, a, a bigger bowl like this, I could have put that in the middle of it, but there wasn't very much pineapple. So I'm actually just gonna throw this away. And then while I was gone, Ashley made me a pan of uh, brownies. Super yummy. And then I've got this salad. I just have the lettuce in here with all the fixings. I'll put it together when I get to the house. So that's ready to go. I'm just gonna put these in the fridge, keep them cold. All right, unfortunately, I just spent the last hour plus trying to find the footage from yesterday and today. I can't find it anywhere on that disc. And I'm so bummed. I'm so, so, so bummed. It was such a good day yesterday with Ash. I literally am so sad because I recorded so many cute videos of her playing with her friends from a distance to keep their, you know, their themselves private, give them privacy or whatever. 
but it was just so cute and like Chelsea was with us and she was with her friend Henry and <laughs> so sad I can't find the footage like the whole file for yesterday and today are gone I have everything before that <sighs> I have no idea it doesn't say that the disc is corrupt or anything like that I don't know if it formatted I don't I have no idea and why just yesterday and today so to give you oh, I'm so mad it's like half the video this morning <sighs> so I'm just gonna give you a uh, better light this way my kitchen is so clean imagine me wiping this counter down imagine me cleaning out the sink that's not now full of dishes this dishwasher is now clean I, I started that load I had washed every one of these snapware Tupperwares I laid them out on towels I don't have enough footage and videos for the rest of this week and I have to come up with other videos I cleaned this whole area I got the so the really melty butter off of here and put it onto a plate and cleaned these trays cleaned this entire counter I'm giving you a play-by-play -play of what I did boxes of cereal we're still doing the last two boxes of cereal because it's hot and we're not cooking except for brownies I gave her the okay on the brownies because we were under 90 degrees so we were okay with that but I'm still bummed but Jason will be proud of me I should have documented it but I know now it wouldn't have mattered because I wouldn't have the footage but I did in fact you know how women wives toss the recycling out to the garage Jason will be proud that I have recycled everything except for one big chunk of cardboard over there and yes why is his car here and not mine again part of the footage for the day he took my cute little bag out of my car last night gave me his car for the day he actually remembered to take my tennis shoes out and put them in that or leave them in that bag and my socks so that I could go for my walk this morning but he had to take my car I feel like I'm repeating my entire day and I am <laughs> so I haven't I don't have the footage um, he had to take my car because it's bigger and he had to take all the shoes back to the store from their health fair I would love to count how many times Chelsea uses this cute little house and I tell her put it back put it back looks really cute right here on my cute little little tray I don't decorate it very often I don't keep flowers alive on there apparently I should go and snag some more of these somewhere um, so he had to take my car to get all the shoes back to the store so that he doesn't have to go back up there tomorrow he's done he is tired um, he's where he worked hard at the health fair all week but he was also having to go back and forth to the store payroll office you know ordering all the stuff so he's just tired so I actually need to call him because I'm leaving here in 10 minutes to go to his brother's house to see his sister and brother-in-law who are in town from Virginia and um, I'm pretty sure he's going to want some shorts, don't you think? Why? Dad. Because yeah. he's wearing pants and a shirt right now at work. Are we staying outside? No, but it, you know, he just, I feel like he's going to want to change. Yeah. This girl has been tired today. Sure I lost is. all the footage from the lake yesterday. Why? I don't know. It's just gone. And you guys were so cute out on the platform and the dock. And then I was proud of where yeah I have one video I have one video oh. they can have it here but it's <laughs> vertical so hi Chelsea we're gonna go in 10 minutes can you go change well, I don't, know what pants. don't wear pants it's, gonna, it's hot put what on your that's what I meant okay put on your cute shorts that you got in Hawaii and that tank top is just fine don't eat the brownies I'm not I'm just she's eating inside so coming off. I've already gotten ready. I got oh. an hour early to straighten my hair because my hair is wrapped. 
Yeah, but it was. Let's see the straighten your hair. No, well, it when it's poofy, it, and then I don't like it. Well, when she doesn't brush it. Yeah. yeah. Okay. You need to get dressed, and then um, let whatever her name dot out for a minute. I'll go on she on said, on. I'll be let her out for like a good two hours. Okay, then leave her alone, Ash. We gotta go. So. Um, That's UFOs are like. What? Covered in water. That's okay. We're gonna head up. Obviously, I will tuck you away a little bit when I'm at Jason's brother's house. Um, try and document as much of it as we can and see what else we get up to after we get back. It's actually, it's actually really blurry. Is it but going? It's going, yeah. Okay. Well, as I thought would happen, I didn't film anything while we were having dinner. We had a good time, but we're on our way back. And I'm with Abby and Ashley, and we were on the highway, and this lady is walking back against you know, traffic on the highway alone. And we went clear to the next exit, and there's no broken down car. So she's just walking on the she's highway? She's just walking on the highway, and so I circled around, and I'm back on the highway. She's up by the sign. She's right up here. You need to, like, pull off. It's hard because the railing. Hold on, I'm going to turn this off. Yeah. She's, like, up here. Don't go into her. Just go off. No, honey. Oh, she did help you. She doesn't look like she needs she's coming back. No. She just kept, she has a water bottle. She's just walking. I don't know why she's walking on the side of the highway then. Where's my emergencies? I'll look up the hazards. It's on here. I'll look it up. Oh, sorry. All right, now I'm gonna show you. She refused help. Um, but it looks like. A cop just pulled over. Hold on, I should have to find an open spot to go. Yeah, I have to buckle up and stuff. So, yeah, I asked her if she wanted help. And she said, no, I don't want any, I don't know if she understood me. She kind of looked homeless. Her water bottle was empty. Oh. She looked a little disheveled. But, like, <laughs> You could literally be on the other side of this highway and be walking down a regular road. So I'm glad the cop is with her. Anyway, I had to run after her because she wasn't, she didn't pay attention to the fact that I stopped. And then she saw me running and, anyway, I'm glad the cop found her and is kind of blocking off traffic from the right lane. So we'll let him take care of her. Uh, yeah. Okay, now the cop is on me. <laughs> I'll just let him know. He's probably going to come to your side, Abby. All right, well, hang on. I'll be Put the camera down. Hey, you guys doing okay? Yeah, I just saw her. I was heading down the highway when I saw that lady mm -hmm. on the side of the road. Yep. So I circled around and came back and asked her if she was okay. Okay, I got gotcha. you. But she refused any help, so. Yeah, we got a couple calls about her, so. Okay. I'm having her take the next exit. She doesn't want to ride, she doesn't want any help, so. Okay. I if just... she doesn't take the next exit, we're gonna pick her up, because she can't be walking here. Yeah, But I just scary. wanted to make sure that you guys were okay. Yeah, I just was like, if anyone can pull over, it's like three women. <laughs> right. You know well, what I mean? Like, I, I don't want to intimidate her, but like. No, I get it. I appreciate you helping. Yeah. All right, well, you guys are good to go. We're good, thank you. That's Have fun. a good night. All right, bye. Ashley and Chelsea are getting little icies on our way home. And, uh, anyway, the cop, yeah, he didn't pull me over. I just explained the situation to him, as you heard. So, we we're heading home after a mild eventful evening. Way to end our evening.